Sophie was a clever girl, and she had some really big plans. She wanted to work hard and save all her money and go on a trip to Japan. She had a camera and she got a box and as many backgrounds as she could get. Then she said, I'm open for business. Come and get a picture of your pet. People came from all around. They came from near and far. They came on their bikes and they came on the bus and they came in trucks and cars. No matter where you went in town, you could always hear someone say, Did your pet get a photo with Sophie yet? You should go and get one today. Every day the line grew longer, Sophie was on a roll. Her pet photo business was growing fast, and soon she would reach her goal. Sophie's schedule was outside the door, hanging up near the top. She was open for business every day, but on Sundays, she closed her shop. There were many more pets to meet, and a lot more money to make. But on the Sabbath, once a week, Sophie would take a break. One of the customers saw the sign and said, Excuse me, miss. I don't understand. No pet photos on Sunday? What is the reason for this? The Lord has been good to me, said Sophie. He gave me my mind and my heart. He gave me my hands and my eyes and my ears and my love for making art. He gives me water and air to breathe and beautiful skies of blue. He gives me new days when the sun comes up and he gives me new friends like you. I try my best to remember him and I haven't forgotten him yet. And if I save one day for him each week, hopefully I'll never forget. I hope you're not mad, said Sophie. I don't want you to feel ignored. But the Sabbath day is a special time for me when I try to remember the Lord. I see what you're saying, the woman said. So on that day, instead of rushing, you find a nice quiet spot to rest and you sit there doing nothing? It isn't a day for nothing, said Sophie, but it's different from all the others. I try to learn about Jesus Christ and I serve my sisters and brothers. One Sunday I took a beautiful photo of some flowers and a plant. And I wrote a nice note to go with the photo and mailed them to my aunt. On another Sunday, I gathered up things that remind me of Jesus Christ, and I took a special photo that I keep with me to remember his sacrifice. I also go to church on the Sabbath, where I pray and sing praises to him, and I take the sacrament bread and water to renew my covenants again. Thanks for telling me about your Sabbath day. I think I understand. If you want to remember Jesus Christ, that sounds like a pretty good plan. Verily my Sabbaths you shall keep, for it is a sign between me and you throughout your generations, that ye may know that I am the Lord that doth sanctify you. 
Did you know we create lesson plans and activity pages to go with our videos every week? They're made by a professional teacher just for kids. Tell your teacher. Tell your mom. They're on our website. LatterdayKids.com